This is lesson 33 and you are welcome on board. The topic is prayer of agreement. You see, if you have started this section with me from lesson 26, I began to talk about faith. And I began to talk about how faith comes. That faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. You see, and I told you how faith works. Faith only works when you hear God. Like that woman with the issue of blood, she heard about Jesus. Now that's the first thing to faith. Then she believed that Jesus, who healed other people and even raised the dead, can heal her of the flow of blood that she had had for 12 years. Now having believed, which is the second step, the first step is hearing the word. The second step is believing the word. The third step is that now he took action. She took action and went out. You see, she went out to meet Jesus. That Jesus can heal me. Let me go and touch the hem of his garment. You see, you see, that is it. No, so that is the thought. But this, the, the fourth point is that she spoke. She said in her heart, if I can touch the hem of her garment, of his garment, I'm going to be healed. That's number four. Then number five is that once she took that action, she got healed. So healing comes when you take action. Now, one of the actions to take is that you have to pray. If you are sick in your body, you are listening to the sound of my voice, then you need prayer. You need to pray and ask God, God, now I need the healing. Now, but if you know that you cannot pray alone, you need somebody, maybe some people, they cannot pray alone. They don't believe only in themselves. If you are like that, the Bible tells us how to pray when we cannot pray alone. In Matthew chapter 18, Bible says we should look for somebody. Say, if two of you shall agree, touching anything that they shall ask of my father, my father will do it. So look for somebody, a Christian, a, somebody who believes in healing or divine, you know, in miracle. A Christian born again, look for that person, agree with that person concerning your sickness. God will heal you. The Bible says where two or three are gathered together in my name, I am there. So if you know you cannot pray alone, look for a Christian, let him agree with you, pray together, and the prayer of faith is going to heal you because you pray in agreement with faith with that person. God honors the prayer of agreement. God honors you when you call another Christian, you agree with that Christian and say, look, this is what I'm going through. I need you to agree with me in prayer. When that person agrees with you in prayer, surely God will do it. Prayer of agreement is powerful. The person doesn't have to be a pastor, you know. The person does, does not have to be a, 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 a minister of God. A Christian is enough. Once you agree with that Christian for the healing of your body, and both of you believe God will surely heal you because that is the promise of our Lord Jesus Christ in the book of Matthew chapter 18 from verse 18. Hallelujah. Thank you so much. I'll see you in the next lesson.